What is going on guys? This is Jack. Welcome back to the channel. And here is my new character in No Man's Sky. This is a little fast. It moves really fast on this camera. But I've done a little customization. Oh gosh, I'm sorry. I can't do this any slower. But look at that face, guys. Oh gosh, I decided to choose some random crazy alien creature and I changed his uh the spacesuit a little bit just to make it okay I got it I gotta stop that we're gonna exit um yes change change the uh spacesuit to make it a little bit more I don't know cool looking went with like a gold black and white theme so guys I am a on a like a space station check that out oh look somebody else is coming in now so the game is multiplayer but you're gonna run into a lot, apparently, a lot of uh, um, NPCs. So check this out. So people come in, they've got some ships. Now this is something I figured out here, is if you go up here, you can select it, and you see like this character come in. This is his ship, apparently. And you can actually, you know, without kind of without kind of going into that you can actually say make an offer and you can negotiate a price and they'll tell you what they've so my current starship has 15 slots but this one has 28 slots so it's got double the capacity but look how much they want for this one guys five and a half million units which is crazy crazy I'm sure I'm sure I could get to that point where I could afford something like that, but right now, I don't have it. Whoa, look at all the other ships that have come in. Got some other ships. That one's kind of cool. Um, uh, that, that was okay. Oh, that one's kind of cool looking. But yeah, you, so you can like do this with any of them. You can come up to them and, as I said, you can, you can basically chat with them and make an offer find out how much how much they are um let's see how much this one is just us uh, only only about two million units not bad um so that's definitely something you can do in this game is do that um p upgrade your ship you can buy more ships you don't have to necessarily get rid of this one uh, let's let me cruise upstairs here at this space station and we'll look around so some other things that you can do here actually let's start over here this is where you can uh, mess around with your character and let's just let's just jump into it um, I've already obviously got mine set currently but let's say you want to change something around there's five different races Let's just say, yeah, we're going to change it. You, can, you got this guy, which is, there's some, this is the anomaly race. And you can tell there's all kinds of different, different stuff. Kind of looks like a stormtrooper there. Um, but different kind of presets that you can use to kind of start customizing your character. You've got the Viking, Viking character, and they've got some different different versions of them obviously I went with one of these I think the one I started looked uh, yeah looks like that guy um, and let's see the traveler look at these guys they're like sea creatures or something look at that he's like Johnny number five on short circuit if you've ever seen that movie that old movie look at that guy's head what is that thing I don't know it's pretty cool actually a pyramid I don't know there's some there's a bunch of stuff I don't know I don't know but it looks like a cat some crazy cat um then you got these little short guys look at that funny hat so these are like all kinds of different characters and creatures and races and whatnot this one seems like the robotic ones this guy guys this one this is like Daft Punk and I almost went with that one but I've I kind of just figured it wasn't that interesting. But anyway, there's all kinds of different things you can choose here. Just to kind of get you started. And then you can go in and you can customize and change. Change like colors and change the style of armor and all that. It's pretty cool. 
I'm actually gonna exit and I'm gonna say do I want to apply changes no so I just go back to my regular guy but it looks like you could just go ahead and do that as often as you want which is pretty cool pretty cool uh, other stuff that's around here there's technology merchant and I think basically what you can do here is you can just kind of purchase technology upgrades so you see you can buy blue blueprints um, I'm pretty sure I don't have what it takes I don't have enough uh, clusters nanite clusters or anything like that neural stimulator I don't I don't even know I need to spend some time just kind of reading through all of this but look rocket boots that's cool um, anyway just another thing to do um, as you go through I don't know what you can do with this stuff you may not be able to do anything with it uh, it seems like there's more like things you can uh, like merchants you can interact with over here and you can sell some stuff over here as as you kind of collect some resources and stuff in your in your uh, uh, travels and stuff so that's pretty cool I don't I haven't really looked around here much I basically decided to f I flew here and we're gonna go get into some flying. We're gonna fly around a little bit and check out kind of where I'm at. Uh, but I, basically the mission just kind of sent me over here to this planet. You can see it up there at the top of the screen, that little red symbol, that that is the planet I was supposed to fly to. So there was the space station hanging out over it. Mathematician, I don't honestly know what any of this stuff is. Let's just, let's just kind of click through them. Uh, on my visor Okay So see you can ask for directions um, Offer a gift whatever Let's just leave um, Anyway, I, it's oh here we go here we go So you can go up to these guys and I am pretty sure you can You could do some uh, uh, trading and selling of various things I don't think I'm I'm at that point because I'm still kind of going through the tutorial I think station terminus oh it's a teleporter hey that's cool I don't know anything about that but in the meantime guys let's cruise over here to the uh, let's cruise over here to the ship and we'll just do a quick little fly about so here we go we push w and it kind of this is all autopilot i'm not doing any of that but here we go so planetary whoa is kind of a little oh there we go i'm just not moving so this unknown planet you can see i've got like some you have these little icons around your around everything uh, to tell you like where to go so let's let's just let's do this let's see how long 40 minutes so let's let's go ahead and tag that and kind of just put the ret the uh, reticle right there and if I hit the space bar you just push it and it'll basically send you for like see obviously that was only like five seconds it's gonna take me down into the through the atmosphere to land on the planet this is the first time I've actually done this just for the record so this is where it wants us to go I don't know anything of whoa am I supposed to okay I think I was supposed to land all right let's slow down let's slow down let's go find I figured it would just take us in okay here we go Let's go land here. The signal source. Wow, that, that was kind of ugly. Ugly landing, but we'll take it in nice and smooth here. All right, here we go. I think we can just, is it gonna land? Oh, I gotta push E. Okay, let's go back. Let's get this landing thing down, okay? Okay, guys. Here we go. Let's go ahead and just hit 
Initiate the landing sequence, pushing E. Pushing e. Interesting parking spot. Alright, follow the coordinates and find the signal source. So let's hop off and let's take a quick look. If you look over there, I'm on Nagel. Weather's overly warm. See what? Yeah, it's a little warm. Radiation's low. Toxicity's up a little bit. New planet discovered. Press P to upload and rename. P. Track. So I tracked the mysterious signal. Now I need to find the cache. Follow the mysterious sing signal to learn more. So let's go here. Let's check this out. Broken technology. I'm probably going to have to repair this, I'm guessing. Log entry, blah, blah, blah. The sparking wires of the machine generate a signal. Tapping out, it's broadcast into the void. Whoever left the message is long gone. Let's decipher the signal. No fuel in. Cause fail to reach station. Hazard protection low. No choice but to. Cause underground. Cause deployed. Base computer. As well as the log entry, the signal contains plans for a base computer and a terrain manipulator. With any luck, the base computer will hold more information about whoever is leaving these messages. So let's download these plans. Now we've got the terrain. Looks like we got the technology for the terrain manipulator. It's going to require two carbon nanotubes and one dihydrogen jelly. Okay. That's doable. So, let's see what we've got in the inventory. I may be able to I may be able to do this. Let's see here. Okay, so there's some ferrite dust. Let's just collect that for the heck of it. What are these things? Oh, more ferrite dust there. All right. What about this ferrite dust? Let's actually just Oh. Journey milestone accomplished. Okay, cool. Travel 10 kilometers. Okay, I just did a sk quick scan. Let's, um... Let's look around here. Pure ferrite, huh? Cool. Let's see what this stuff is. Save and chart. Unknown sector. Alright. There we go. Mine copper to build the base computer. Okay. We'll just leave that where it is. And, um, yeah, let's just keep looking around. Destination reached. So do I, like... Oh, there we go. Look at that. Salvage technology. Two, three, four. Nice, guys. That's cool. Alright, we need to find some... We need to find some copper. So let's do this. Let's get into here and let's go... This is my res... Let's, um... How do I put it down? I want to be able to put this is this this signal booster, right? So destroy discard transfer items. I wonder if I can just push this. There we go. Do it. Nope. Okay, boost that. So this is my signal booster, and I think it can... So here we go. Perfect. So this is going to tell me where everything is. Manufacturing facility detected. Okay, cool. So... Now I just need some... Uh... Let's do the scan. I need to find where the, the copper is. I don't remember the, the uh, symbol for copper. I 
can pick that up, I believe. So O2 is oxygen. Na is sodium. All right, let's see if I can do this. Thermal protection. Let's go here. Hazard protection. Charge it with some sodium. There we go. Oh, what is this? Look at that little guy. I don't need the terrain manipulator. Uh. Oh. See that stuff that was like below the, the earth? Watch. Scanners recharging. Okay. Still charging. What's that? Oh, that's the man manufacturing facility. Okay. I saw something under here. What is this stuff right there? What is that? Carbon crystals. Right, so far, what is that stuff? Ferrite dust. Oh, here we go! Yeah, I'm getting tons of copper, boys. I knew I saw something below the earth. All right, I need eighty. Looks like. This goes really deep. Oh. Okay. Uh, create or deploy a refinery to build. Oh, I'm staying away from that guy. Hate those guys. They're just kind of little freaks. Okay. Next, let's see here. This is, I don't want the signal booster. I want the portable refinery. Let's put that down. And can I just hit Z? No, I honestly don't know how to get rid of that once it's in. So put that in, let's put in, let's put in my copper, which is Let's see. There it is. CU. It's copper. Fuel supply should be good. Let's just, uh. Chromatic metal? Is that what I need? Let's put in some carbon. Sure. Let's do it. In the meantime, I'm gonna go get some. Let's get some carbon because I just used a bunch of it. I need to make sure I've got some. Okay. What's there? Output. Let's take it. Let's put it in the exosuit. Perfect. And then we're going to pick that up. Easy peasy. Okay. The base computer claims a site for construction. Find a suitable area and deploy the base computer accessible with the build menu. Let's... Let's get back to the base. Let's get inside. What is this? Deuterium rich plant. Okay. Cool. I think my... Let's do this. Let's find where my... It's right over there. Okay. We're back at the ship. And we have to put this base computer 
down. So we need to, as the uh, little tutorial section says, find a suitable area and deploy the base computer. Access the build menu, Z. So there we go. Question is, do I want to build it here? And I kind of don't think so. Let's, uh... I don't know. Let's go check it out up here. Let's see what's up here. That's pretty handy for, like, when you need to ascend. It's not really helpful when you need to go somewhere fast. All right. Let's do it right let's do it right over here. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let's pop it out. Base computer. Let's put it somewhere kind of flattish cuz I'm assuming I'm going to build here. There we go. Can I just Oh, right click. Right click does that. Okay. Okay. Uh sounds good. Put that down. Searching cartographic archives. Universal archive search reveals no prior claims on this site. Sonar test confirms site is suitable for construction. Let's claim this for a base. Boom. Achievement unlocked, looks like. Okay. Okay, so it says we can use it. Accessing log from previous user. Storm sweeping across, cause, but construction supplies low. Depositing shelter plans while cause, need to cause, back soon. <laughs> uh, all right, I got plenty of plenty of carbon for a wall. Very good. So let's do base components. Let's uh, see if I can. Wooden components. All right. So the first thing I think I need to do is put down. Yeah, put down one of these. So, so I, this is still part of the tutorial guys. Like all of this is part of the tutorial. All right, we'll do that. And then let's go with some walls. Let's go wall. Okay, I need more carbon. No worries. Let's uh, go ahead and exit out. And run over here. Is this ferrite? Or let's just do this. Here, exit out of everything. That's ferrite. These little things. Definitely, definitely carbon. All right, I'm going to gather a bunch of carbon, enough for the rest of this base. And I'll bring you back in a minute as soon as I'm kind of ready to do some construction. Okay, let's see if I have some more. Wooden components. Let's grab a wall. Let's see. Okay, let's do a wall there. Gosh, I need a lot more. Okay. And let's see what this wood frame. That's 40 also. Okay, no worries. Okay. Okay. All right. Then we just exit out and go get some more. Need more carbon-based crap. There's actually one problem with this uh, little area is that there's not a lot of like plant type I mean I guess there are these tiny little things I guess maybe I'll just go over here and work on some of these some of these uh tree like guys what is this pure ferrite see that that's what I'm saying all right let's just go for this guy Okay, we're back at base. I think I have enough stuff here. Let's go with wooden components. We're gonna put a wall down. I I think all you have to do is basically build a is build a very basic uh, structure here. 
There we go. I think that's it. Base archives updated. Check this out. It's like a tech door in Ark. Check that out. Check that out. Yeah, look at those. Look at those lips. Those lips go crazy. Okay, I think I got a storm coming. Return to the base computer. Okay, base computer. Okay. Construction largely because a success recovered salvage technology from nearby plans logged scans indicate additional subterranean devices beginning search Okay, downloads of plants whoever recorded these logs evidently had some success I have access to their plans and perhaps I can learn from their efforts New building parts learned blueprint analyzer Okay Magnetized ferrite and one carbon nanotube. Okay. Uh, let's see if I can make any of that stuff. Let's go here. One carbon nanotube. Beautiful. And let's see, what are the other things I needed? I needed some sort of... Um... Uh, what was it? Magnetized ferrite? Wait, it probably says. Let's exit out of there. Blueprint analyzer requires magnetized ferrite. Place pure ferrite in the portable refiner. Let's transfer. Let's put pure ferrite in there. Maybe that's all I can put in. Let's start that up. And then because it's falling, I'm going to see if this helps my... Yeah, cool. Okay. So this is stabilizing my temperature. Let's get that back up to normal. That 25 should be enough because it looks like I need a 20. So we'll go here. Pop in here. Pick that up. I just pick up oh it used to everything I guess huh okay and then we go then I think we're gonna go into our construction blueprint let's maybe that's it portable technology I don't honestly know blueprint analyzer there we go okay we'll just drop this right here too Okay. And Anal analysis unit online awaiting input. Diagnostic su su <laughs> diagnostic suggestion. User should recover buried technology from dig sites. Equip and utilize an analysis visor. So I actually do have something. Let's see here. Okay, so look, I can make all this stuff. Table, chair, furniture. So I can learn all of this stuff. All right. Well, I guess that is this base tutorial. We got through that section. We can't pick up this uh, base computer, but it looks like there's some emergency happening. And we need to investigate it. So that is going to wrap it up for today's episode, guys. Um, once again, just kind of checking stuff out here. Learning how this stuff goes. But this is pretty cool. Let me see if I can get a good... Let's see if I can get a good view here. As I... um. There we go. Let's select that. Check this out, guys. There we go. Hey, let's... Let's, let's get away real quick. There we go. Base computer. I've pulled up the spaceship. Super cool. Um, but guys, that is going to do it. Bosh, screenshot. It's going to do it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm really enjoying this No Man's Sky. There's, it feels like I'm barely scratching the iceberg. Or scratching. Is that right? Scratching the iceberg. Pretty sure that's not right. So just, uh, I'm just get like doing the very 
the very first stuff and I feel like there's a lot more to get done here. So this is going to be cool. I'm looking forward to exploring the galaxy. I don't want this to be my permanent base obviously. This is just kind of the tutorial. But my plan is to kind of explore and find a nice cool planet that's got like it's a little bit more uh, habitable. Habitable? Yes, habitable. Some place that's nicer, a nicer place to live that's not so toxic. That's not so ugly. Look how ugly this place is, guys. But anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed the episode. As always, if you did enjoy it, hit that thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more No Man's Sky action. And we will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.